Hey everyone, Damo here with another Boom Beach video. So in today's video guys, we've got a few things to go over. Let's start with number one. So as you can see, I've finally reached 1100 victory points. I just got there about five minutes ago. So that was pretty exciting. So it's been a long time since I've been up this high in VP. I think the last time was probably, at le I'd have to say at least two years ago, two and a half years ago. And that was when I did like my first sort of mini VP push. And I got up to about, I think I got up to like 1130 VP. 1132 I think is my record. So I did that, anyway, I got bored of it uh, once I got that high. Uh, and that's why I decided to give it up. So yeah, we're back at 1100 VP. We're gonna keep pushing, gonna keep going forward. That's pretty exciting. Uh, the reason we're able to do that is because I got instant training for another, <clears throat> excuse me, for another month. So I'm super pumped about that. It just makes my life so much easier when I'm doing my attacks. I don't need to worry about like all my warriors getting destroyed or whatever. So that's, you know, that's an amazing thing. So today's video, we are gonna be jumping into, not Mega Crab, that's gonna be later on, Dr. T Tropical for the 1st of June, I believe, which is kind of crazy that it's, yeah, it's June already, it just like, blows my mind so I'm gonna try and celebrate a little bit with having instant training and use some crazy troop combos that nobody would ever want to use and we'll see how we go so as you can see heavies crinears four of each and bullet I'm probably gonna change the hero because I can but yeah let's just see what these guys can do oh and I'm also fully boosted because I'm gonna be doing some crab hits uh, after this I th yeah, I think I am anyway. So yeah, that's stage one. Smashed it, the heavies are pretty powerful. At the end of this video, I'll show off the uh, heavy stats and the cranius stats. Because I think I've got the, oh, let's just do it now. I do have the tri boost of the heavy health. And I've got all 10 statues boosted. So the health on the heavies is, damn, 10-7. It's pretty good. We're doing like 300 damage per second. Crineers are doing uh, 90 damage per second and we've got 2,000 health. So yeah, that's pretty cool. So, Dr. T stage two, let's get into it. It would be pretty awesome if I could uh, take down all seven stages with Crineers and Heavies. I'm not sure what you would call that troop combination, but yeah. Be pretty cool if I could do it. I don't think I will be able to. I might need to throw in like a boat of, Zor a boat of Zookas or some a Scorch or something. I'm not. I'm not really too sure. But yeah, we've got 208 combo energy. That's mental. All right, stage two completed. We got two little frags. Uh, yeah, let's just get into stage number three. So I do have a mini announcement to make at the end of this video. So if you're you know, if you made it this far, keep watching because there is some other news coming, which I think you'll find, I hope you find it exciting. I'm not sure. I find it pretty exciting. So I'll just hope that you do, that you will do too. So let's get all these critters going because, because we can, that is a huge amount of critters. Oh yeah. So it's critter, the critter tribe as well, which is the 50% less. And as you can see, they are running crazy look at all those look at all of them boom stage three i think we've just created a new uh a new attack strategy heavies and crioneers so stage number four this is where we're going to start seeing some sort of resistance i think hq has got like 200k got a couple of rockets a shock launcher three rockets all right so let's go one, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, and bullets. So let's shock the shock launcher. Hey, the heavies are actually doing some work. It's, I'm liking this strategy. The thing I don't like about Crane is though is they just sort of walk off randomly a lot of the times I find. For what seems like no real reason. Oh, so I've got a 
huge amount of uh, gunboat energy. So let's just call these critters going, just like a wave of them. Yeah, this is going to be taken down. The stage is going to be taken down pretty easily as well. There's just so many critters to contend with. So many. And then the Crinairs are smashing it. Oh, we did lose a Crinair. He must have got popped off by a boom cannon or something. Oh, yay, there. Well, that's that. So yeah, instant training. If you if you have the chance to get it, you know, if you've like a little bit extra cash knocking about, uh, I strongly recommend getting it because it is a game changer. Game changer. All right, let's get a different um, hero. Let's go. Yeah, let's do critter swarm. Just get more critters coming in. All right, let's go back. Let's go stage number five. Can we do it? If I got five stages done, I'd be real happy. So we got like 363 on the HQ. Couple of boomies, rockets. All right, let's do this. So we go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Critters, one, two. Yeah, let's just let them work their magic. Right, let's do critters there. Oh, somebody's getting low on health. Is that a heavy? Yeah, he must have taken a couple of boomies to the feast. Let's, what should we do? Okay, let's let all those troops take up the sniper and the mortar on the right. And then let's flare everyone together. So let's drop a artillery on that. We need two artilleries. Let's hope that everybody stays together which they do. So we've got 200 gumbo energy, or like 190 or 180 or whatever it was, I'm not sure. And let's just spam these critters. Spam, 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 spam. Yeah, I think this is gonna be stage number five taken down. So let's just throw a couple of shocks because we can. Man, look at that. Look at that. That really is a sight to see, isn't it? I mean, they're not doing much damage, but it's pretty awesome to see that. That's cool. That's cool. I'm, getting, I'm glad I used it. heavies and cronies today. And we only lost one heavy. It's pretty impressive, I think. Stage number five, one heavy down. I mean, they do have, you know, a 10 offensive boost going, so... Oh, why, am I, why am I clicking on Mega Crab? I'm just too excited to get back into it. Um, stage six. <sighs> I'm not crazy confident. How can I do this? Let's try and uh, be a bit tricky. So we've got, what's that, like 396 on the HQ. Right, so let's flare there. We'll put that there. We'll go one, two, three, four. Put another smoke. One, two, three, four. And we'll put another smoke. All right, so let's just come around down there. Let's throw a shock. And let's just hope everybody can gather. I think I, oh, I think they took a lot of damage there. Those cronies, I've got to get them, got to get some separation so that they don't take all that splash. All right, so it's going to get some critters out now. I mean, I've got so much gumboot energy. I'm not, I don't know why I'm not like, Taking advantage of it. Okay, so let's get another shock there. I feel like I could take this down. Right now I'm feeling pretty confident. It's just getting that separation between the heavies and the crinears. But they seem to be it's I mean it's sort of hard to see how much uh, health everything has. Like I see a few heavies with some low damage, but um not low damage, low health. But they seem to be doing a thing. So let's just throw another shock there because we can. Let's flare onto the HQ. Let's throw our last little gumbo energy in the way of a artillery. And yeah, that is gonna be stage number six taken down. I mean, that wasn't terrible actually. That worked out pretty well. I'm, yeah, I'm. Yeah, I would say that I'm happy with that because. It's heavies and crinears. Who uses heavies and crinears? So you lost three heavies, seven crinears. We've got our little guaranteed crystal and a piece of intel. So let's instant train. Gotta love it. All right, so let's scout stage seven because I'm not 
I mean, I'm going to give it a crack. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do what I want to do. Do I want to be a bit strategic and take out... Let's see what's on the HQ. So it's like... 3... 460? 460. So that's going to require a lot of clearing. So I'm going to take out that shock launcher because I think that's just going to be a pain. 1, 2. So that still leaves us 158. Hopefully that is enough to take it down. I don't think it's going to be. I'm going to need a couple of... Uh, what, three artilleries? Okay. So we're at 146. So there are three rocket launchers. I think I'm just going to do the flaring thing that I did last time. So let's flare to there. Oh. Flare to there. Let's throw our smoke. We'll go one heavy, two heavies, three heavies, four heavies, another smoke, one cryo, two cryo, three cryo, four cryo, and this ever spark. And let's get gathered up over here. So I just want to get over here and then let's shock that throw some critters let's do the ever spark critter swarm and I think if I just keep clearing if I get that separation I've got to be smart with my gumbo energy let's shock there so that we get those rocket launchers mortars and stuff Okay, we came across onto those machine guns, which I didn't really want to do because I don't think that I need to do that. So let's come back. Flare. We still got a good amount of critters out. Throw some down. Let's do another shock on those rocket launchers and mortar. So let's see what else we do. We've got, yeah, we've still got a healthy amount of gunboat. I feel like my, my heavies are getting low on health. I mean, there's a lot of green health bars, which has got to be pretty promising, I'd say, right? So let's flare onto the HQ. And do I want to just keep dropping critters, is the question. Maybe? I mean, you know, this is actually going to work. This is kind of crazy. My heavies are smashing at... Look at that. I mean, it's going down pretty slowly, but hey, we did it. We did it. That's a great way to uh, celebrate getting endless reserves. So that is stage number seven of Dr. T Tropical for the 1st of June, taken down with Cryoneers and Heavies. So I only lost two Heavies, 14 Cryoneers. Hey, that's pretty, I, I'm, I'm pretty impressed with that. Right, so I'm just looking at my little list. What else are we going to go over? So, if you've been watching my other videos, I did, you know, I posted a few Mega Crab ones. We did get the glow, the golden tribal trophy. So before I had the iron, I've got the global, uh, the golden one now. I, uh, if you saw my last video that I did on the crab, it was stages 41 to 45. I did disgusting. I, there was one stage, I think it was 43, and I just like, kept screwing up, it was just like, oh, it was so, it was so annoying, I, I kind of wish I recorded the audio for that, so you could hear the frustration in my voice, but, it is what it is, I didn't want to like, not show it, and be like, ah, oh, I'm perfect at crab, I never make mistakes, that, I just like, I lost it on stage 43, so I just had to like, put it out there, show you what to not do and yeah hopefully you have a good laugh at it good chuckle I looking back now I'm it's a little bit funny but still very annoying so we are up to stage 46 I think this is gonna be a solo I'm not gonna do it now I'm gonna do that in another video but yeah we're up to stage 46 got 18 attacks left um, to get to stage 60 so I'm hopeful I'm going to just keep pushing, try and be smarter about my attacks. Fingers, fingers crossed, because if I don't get it in this time, then I have to wait a whole nother year, and that's just going to be super annoying. So the last thing before I go that I wanted to talk about is, so today I actually hit 102 subscribers on YouTube, which is a pretty big deal for me. So 
it. Everybody that subscribed, everybody that watches my videos, likes, comments, all of that good stuff, I really, really, really appreciate it. I really, really do. It means a lot to see the support. And to get over 100 subs is just, it just blows my mind because, so I first posted my, my first Boom Beach video on YouTube was, I think the 21st of May and I posted a, I think it was a War Factory video. And so what is it now? June, so March, April, April to May, May, so it's like two and a half months, I guess I've been posting Boom Beach, I think now? Yeah, so we'll say two and a half months I've been posting Boom Beach. So before I started posting Boom Beach, I had five subscribers from another game that I was playing. So five, I think five subs, maybe four, maybe, I don't think it was any more than five. So now, you know, start of June, to have 100 subs is very, very exciting for me. It, it really means a lot and I really do appreciate it. So I just want to give a big shout out. I know a lot of YouTubers do like 100 subscriber specials or 1,000 subscriber specials, that sort of stuff. Some of them do like Q&A, so if you've got any questions, like feel free. If I get enough questions, then I'll like do a video of like a Q&A or something, I'm not sure. But yeah, I just wanted to give everybody a shout out for um, all the support. It means a lot, it's greatly appreciated and just gonna keep pushing forward and then hopefully we'll hit 200 subs and 300 subs and the sky's the limit. So I'm gonna wrap it up today. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks for uh, all the support. I've said that a hundred times already, but what's one more? Um, remember to like, comment, subscribe if you like this video. Let me know what you think of this new strategy, heavies and cryoneers. I really liked it. I'm kind of tempted to do it tomorrow for uh, for Volcano. So yeah, I will end this here. Thanks very much. And I will talk to you in the next video.